Unraveling Art Threads. Meet the icons of textile art. Hello everyone. Welcome to our English language learning journey. Today, we're going to delve into an exciting and vibrant corner of the art world, textile arts. Specifically, we will learn about some famous textile artists and their remarkable works. Understanding these artists and their creations will not only enrich our appreciation for this unique art form but will also enhance our English vocabulary related to arts and crafts. Before we get into the famous artists and their works, let's first understand what textile art is. It's a form of creative expression where artists use threads, yarns, fabrics, and other materials to create artistic pieces. They might use techniques like sewing, weaving, dyeing, or even knitting. Some common textile art terms are Embroidery The craft of decorating fabric or other materials using a needle to apply thread or yarn. Weaving The process of making cloth by repeatedly crossing a single thread through two sets of long threads. Dyeing the process of adding color to textile products like fibers, yarns, and fabrics. Knitting, a method by which yarn is manipulated to create a textile or fabric. Let's now meet some famous textile artists and explore their fascinating works. 1. Sheila Hicks, known for her innovative use of materials, Sheila Hicks is a famous American textile artist. Her well-known piece, The Silent Braid, showcases her use of colorful and vibrant threads woven together to create an impactful visual narrative. 2. Faith Ringgold, an American artist, best recognized for her narrative quilts. One of her most famous works is Tar Beach, a quilt that tells a story of her childhood in Harlem. 3. Annie Albers, a German-American textile artist and printmaker known for her pioneering wall hangings that she started producing in the 1920s. Black White Gold is one of her most iconic pieces. 4. Louise Bourgeois Although more commonly known for her sculptures and installations, Louise Bourgeois was also a brilliant textile artist. Her series of fabric works in the late 1990s and early 2000s highlighted her diverse skills. That brings us to the end of our journey through the world of textile arts today. I hope this introduction to these talented artists and their impressive works has given you not just new English words and phrases related to arts and crafts, but also a new perspective on this form of creative expression. Remember, Learning a language is not just about vocabulary and grammar. It's about understanding cultures, perspectives, and the many ways humans express their thoughts and emotions. Keep exploring and keep learning.